England's Six Nations victory over Wales has not come without controversy. Rugby icon Sir Clive Woodward believes that England have scored a massive own goal at the Six Nations through their selection policy. Steve Borthwick's side defeated Wales 60-14 on Saturday at Twickenham to claim two wins from two, but without picking up a bonus point against either the Welsh or Italy. Plenty of pre-match talk centered around the Twickenham atmosphere and turning the ground into a cauldron of fear that would both intimidate England's rivals and make the match-going experience more enjoyable for fans. Last year, England were booed off the pitch after defeat to Fiji, but in their first game at home since that day, they were able to put a smile on fans' faces after overcoming a big scare against a young Wales team. Captain Jamie George had submitted several suggestions to the Rugby Football Union, RFU, in an attempt to improve the scenes inside Twickenham. A longer fan walk to the dressing room took place and new caps' names were already up on the honors board inside the changing area. But Woodward believes that a major barrier is still to be overcome. Was at Twickenham as a fan on Saturday. There has been a lot of talk about getting a connection back between the team and supporters and improving the match day experience. Woodward wrote for the Daily Mail. My message to the RFU would be to forget the gimmicks like light shows, DJs and bands which are designed to get the crowd going. You can't force fun. There is no need to try and create it. If England can play in a way that gets fans off their seats with excitement, then the Twickenham atmosphere will take care of itself. Oh, good start would be getting the best players on the field. The sight of Henry Arundel in the Twickenham hospitality boxes rather than on the field on Saturday was another massive own goal that is just devaluing international rugby selection for which should be sacrosanct.